It's good for him to pot shot, but I think he's got to just put his hands together too because he scores, and when he scores, he's got to attack. <laughs> Ruben, see, that's the thing about Ruben. You just never know what's coming at him out of his body. Oh! oh! Shit, get out! He's got to get on him because Ruben is a survivor. Well, I'll tell you, he was out, and then he woke up when he yeah. hit the floor. He looks but right out. now, Cody's standing all over oh, him. Oh, man. And, it, and Steve LaFright, bittersweet. We never wanted to see Ruben lose, but Cody Stamen's another guy we never wanted to see lose. Cody maintaining the TXC title with that head kick. And I'll and tell I mean, you what. He's got to be so excited. If there's a such thing as a good loss, this will be a great loss for Ruben. Ruben fought his heart out. And I mean, Cody well, did a good job jumping on him, increasing the volume, because Ruben is not a guy that you can just walk away from once you get And a head now kick. he knows that, okay, this has worked so far, but it's because I haven't tackled that top level, that top echelon of opponents yet. And now he knows. He knows because he's lost, he's got to go clean that up. But Cody can learn a lot from this fight, too. He can take a lot out of that first round. A little bit of a slow starter. And here we're going to see this replay of the end of everything. Ruben just swinging wildly. You can see the fatigue and the big kick. And, you know, that was all brought on by the fact that Ruben tends to try to block leg kicks with his hands. Cody threw that kick like it was a leg kick and brought it up high. We've seen his, his coach and mentor, Darren Kirkshank, do that in the UFC and win knockout of the night. It's only fitting that the protege gets the same knockout. Great fight for Ruben, but he's going to be able to take away a lot of things from this fight that he can tighten up and clean up. And Cody Stamen moving to 7-0. Outstanding night of fights here. Again, the replay. Cody Stamen, big leg kick, or a big head kick with the leg and then finishing it up. And once again, being reminded why I've always got the best seat in the house. Luckiest MMA fan in all of mixed martial arts. Fight fans, let's hear it for this outstanding main event of the evening! Ruben Bariak and Cody Stamen! afraid to take on tough fights you know a lot of people uh, uh, say that uh, he's been uh, ducking people but uh, hey he uh, puts it on the line you know and uh, you know more power to him and uh, I wish him good luck in the future and uh, I want to thank everybody that came out uh, support me and uh, Detroit Javier from uh, Evolution Detroit uh, 
Anthony Cole from uh, Buckley's Pharmacy, and uh, Cole Armory, and then uh, Conrad Logs from uh, from uh, uh, SoFly Combat League for uh, supporting me during this fight. And then, uh, of course, my teammates, my corner, Brad Burke, uh, Victor Torres, Jason Ireland, and everyone at the gym. And, uh, you know, uh, Michigan top team, they're doing great things over there. And, and, uh, and I wish them uh, the best, so. Ruben, it is a pleasure and an honor to watch you fight. We look forward to seeing you back in here. You're a tremendous athlete and a tremendous warrior. Thank you for being here tonight. Thank you. I'll tell you what, that kid kept me up uh, at night for the last two months. You know, I watch him fight. He completely dominates everybody. You know, he comes out, he comes out ready to fight. He's got no fear. You know, that's that's a fighter's mentality right there. Ruben is a warrior, and I know he's gonna do great things with his career. Uh, you know, and I'm and I'm I'm really humbled, you know, to have an opportunity to get into a cage like that with a guy like that. Uh, you know, hats off to Ruben. Uh, super tough guy, and he's got a he's got a long, bright future ahead of him, I know. Now, Cody, tell me what this does for you and your confidence, taking on a guy like that. This is a guy that nobody wants to fight because he is so tough. Yeah, you know, I, I've, been, I've been saying it since I was, I was 18 years old. I've watched the UFC fight, and you know, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna fight in the UFC. I've known that for a long time, and I'm 7-0 now. I just beat an uh, undefeated, uh, you know, probably the best guy in Michigan. You know, where's my shot? I want a shot. I want a shot at, at the big leagues. I think I deserve it. You know, I, that's my, that's my, uh, that's my 27th fight in the cage, and I've won 26 of them. Uh, what else do I have to do? You know, who else do I have to beat? I don't care who it is. You know, I, I, I'm gonna fight in the UFC this year. Who? What can you take away from this fight tonight? Out of those three rounds, what can you walk away and go back to the drawing board with? You know, I didn't let my hands go the way I wanted to. You know, I have an awesome boxing coach, Caro. <laughs> you know, and so many great coaches. You know, Dino, Darren, everybody. You know, there's so many. Uh, there's so many great people in my corner, you know, my family, my friends, everyone who came out to support me, all my sponsors, you know, all my teammates, Michigan Top Team, Detroit Jiu Jitsu, all you guys, I love you guys. You know, this doesn't happen without you guys. You know, everybody rallies around me and, and helps me get to where I want to go and, and I'm so humble and thankful for you guys in my life, you know, because I wouldn't be standing where I am right now if it wasn't for you. So, you know, hats off to you guys. Thank you so much for, you know, giving me the opportunity to live my dream. Thank you, Cody. Congratulations. Anyone else that you have to thank specifically? Uh, all my sponsors. Check them out on the back of Dan shirt right now. I'm way too excited and... and uh, Evolution Detroit, Patino, Vengeance, DrStubble.com, New Me Tees, The Memory Tag, MetroCal, tons and tons. I mean, look at you. Michigan Top Team, Michigan TT. Michigan TT, ISC Restoration, MetroCal, Top Team, Patino. Uh, vengeance, Detroit Jiu Jitsu, and if I forgot anybody, uh, I'm really sorry. Uh, I'm just, I'm so excited. I'm like a little kid at Christmas right now. I can't even think. Congratulations, Cody. A pleasure watching you here tonight. Woo! Let's go, Cody! Let <laughs> new and still TXC champ Cody Stamen. A big thanks to the man right here, Joe Battaglia, for putting on this show. Fantastic. Ben Quinn for putting on all these matches One as well. One more time on the replay. And a big thanks to all our sponsors, PatinoDiet.com. Always check out TXCLive.com and follow us on Facebook to find out the next great event. Aaron Sires as well. Thank you so much. We really appreciate it. Right in and down Andrew goes Barry. RadioBroadcasting.com. Thank you everyone for being here today. We appreciate you. We'll see you at the next show. And even then, Ruben, no quit in him. Trying to get back to his feet.